oh, 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 this was not a good idea. Hello everyone. As you can see, I'm in the middle of a highly volcanic lake. Welcome to the our next installment of New in Town. Uh, Mr. K is going to be so mad at me for restarting, what's this, the third time, third time, third time's the charm, I swear. It's just, there's such a large gap to when between I play these, and he pushes like amazing updates, amazing bug fixes, amazing everything, and, and here I am, I'm like, well, new version of the game and the data pack, gonna have to start fresh. But don't worry, I'm gonna make up for it. This time, we we pulled out the big guns. As you can see, I have no hero data packs, so this is going to be harder, easier. I'm not sure. It's gonna be something. Um, right now, I'm just uh, I need to find a safe place to start gathering resources. So this time around, the only the only external help I have is timber, which allows me to chop down trees quick quickly. Which is good. It's just a quality of life thing. Uh, other than that, I got, as you can probably tell, the big kahunas of world generation and extraneous dimension generation. So, I have, obviously, Terralith for the overworld. I have Incendium for the nether. I have Nullscape for the end. I have the 11 dimensions of Bracken, the Bracken pack by Bracken Strike, uh, And then... Incendium, Null, Nullscape, Terralith by uh, Stardust Labs and Star Mute. And then I just whipped up a pack recently of my own. It is the Pool Rooms data pack. So, yeah, we got the back rooms in here now, too. And then, of course, uh, the, the basic back rooms are by Mr. Nick. I will have links to all of their packs and channels if they have them. In the description of this video so it should be pretty fun there's gonna be a lot of terrain here and then in of course we got new in town running under the hood as well I really need it to be daytime <gasps> oh yes please and I got the advancement new in town I should probably try to find a flat place near this because this is quite handy to have so I cannot I do not want to go in to any other dimensions aside from maybe the underdark for resources um, until I am like stacked with gear and gear is gonna be kind of hard to get um, considering I got to go in the nether for some of the progression and the nether is especially nasty with incendium and I'm sure as uh, we're all aware I'm not the best Minecraft player out there I'm good at making stuff I'm not good at playing said stuff so uh, And then before I can go specifically in the back rooms areas, I need to have the materials to make another portal because there is no other way out of there. So I could potentially soft, soft lock myself here. Eventually, though, I want to make a tower so I can go through all the dimensions. The way, it, the way it's stacked is obviously I've got Stardust Labs creations that are in the three main worlds, the overworld, the nether, and such but I also have Bracken dimensions to worry about so at the very very top you have Pax which is peaceful dimension which I might build my uh, can I build my new in town settlement there that's a I might try that I, we might we might just do a survival series so I can get to Pax and then build the world generation there Eh, eh you know what no Something might break. I don't. When the Nether attacks, uh, that might be very bad. Also, I know that's a bad idea. <laughs> what am I thinking? So, uh, for those of you who don't remember, when I played this with the Shield Hero Pack, I ran into a right bit of trouble because I couldn't attack anything in my camp. It couldn't attack me, and I couldn't attack it because of the Watchtower. And Pax, since it's the Heavenly Dimension, gives you weakness. So it is an extraordinarily bad idea to make an encampment there. Maybe a base. Maybe if I make my own base, I can make it there. But that should not be where I put my new in town. I think I'm going to keep it keep it in the overworld. So I'm going to try to find a field. Um, 
Aside from that, I'm going to build a tower. At the top, we have Pax, and then the Feywilds, then the Overworld, the Underdark, the Nether, Sanctum, and then I believe the end is underneath that. And then if I fall into the void in the end, it'll stick me in the back rooms. And once, like I said, once I go to the back rooms, uh, well, Nick's back rooms do have way back. My pool rooms do not. So if I go, if I go adventuring anywhere, I should bring the stuff for another portal so I can get back to the overworld easily enough. Ooh, got a ravine. Okay, all right, I see. I might make my base down there if this area over here is nice. Uh, it's, it's serviceable. Looks like ice spikes biome over there. I know it says not to build over water, but surely I can do this, right? Obviously not right there, but let's check over here. Yeah, I think this is uh, this is pretty rocking. I think I'll do this. All right, so town charter. Let's rock and roll, baby. And purple as always. I gotta look into the code and see how he did. He said that's um that's hard coded to match your player ID. Okay, so building permit. I need a mine first. Okay. Settlement site recipes. Should have grabbed a feather. Shouldn't be too big of an issue though. Ah. Oh, it's so nice just to hit something, and have it actually do damage. And he didn't give me a feather. I don't want to be in a situation here where I run out of raw materials, and I know some of these take very strange materials. This looks like a good spot right here. Let's build us a stable right quick. Now though it is getting dark, I must bed down. But I am not ready to deal with monsters just yet. Look at these horses too, I need a saddle. Oh, there's lots of chickens here. Yes, please. All of you can come with me. There's so many. Three will be good though. Yoink, 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 yoink. Nice. Alright, now, let me go find that other one. Ba -ba -ba. Sorry. I need your feathers. Alright, now we can get the the site planning guide. I need the mine and I need the wood mill first. Those are most important. Alright, yep. Just refresh my memory. What did the mine take? Oh, I forgot to get hover. It's slick. So I have an iron pickaxe. I just need an iron shovel, stone, and logs. And I think they do have to be oak, which is fine. There's oak trees here. It, that stone, though, I'm going to have to mine a little bit for. And a zombie, but no one can... Ah, oh, why are there so many obs? Is this a... Oh, it is a thunderstorm. That's right. There was lightning. I need to make a shield. But it'll take away from my iron. No. Come on. Get in. Get in. Get in. Ah, you gotta let, you let a zombie in. Oh, it's bad. It's really bad. Gotta get out. And I broke my axe. Ah, damn. Close the gate. Ah! That didn't happen. Put these on the whole thing. Whole thing. So essentially, 
they got to come through there. Basically, they got to come in through the path. Should be nice and easy to funnel them in. All right. <clears throat> I think I'm good. I'm really not. I need a shield. Toronto. That's one thing I take take for granted when you're a shield hero. Always got the eternal shield. Uh, I also need a chest. I just uh, I, you know what? Next time I play, I gotta add the um, what was it? The sack. The the sack. The sack in a box. Uh, the the bundle. That's what I need. There was a comment on my uh, last survival playthrough. They recommended I use a bundle. I agree. At first, I thought I was being really dumb. I was like, is that a super simple thing I could have crafted to make my life easier? And I looked, I'm like, oh, no, they didn't add a recipe. You can only find it as loot. But data packs are to the rescue, as always. Yes, yes, yes. Sleep through the night. We do not want We're going we're gonna to stop it. We're going to stop it at two deaths. That is going to be it. No more. I have a chest here too I could use. Uh, bup, 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 bup. Grindstone will save till I can get a, a blacksmith built up. All right, I really need a mine now. There was that hole in the ground over there I wanted to check out. Uh, let me make sure. I think I'm good on my shield. Uh, bup, 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 build. Stuff to build out, okay. Oh, there's another chicken. Oh yeah, right here. Perfect. I wanted this water too. That's well, I gotta be careful. Uh, okay. There's some iron. Yeah, I gotta. You see all this? That's the the wall is lined with one way tickets to the pool rooms. If any of those falling blocks hit me while I'm underwater, I'm screwed. So I go to the pool rooms now. I'm not well. I won't be in any immediate danger but it's not going to be much of a not much of a playthrough then at that point ow yes sir all right torch let's grab some more some more of this all right so i'm gonna leave it there so when we get back we will we will see about adding a wood wood woodsmith and a mine to get us get us going on materials here. Um, so I do want those kind of grinding up in the background because those just base materials I'm going to use for everything else. Everything else is more specialized, but um, I want to get those two going, and then we'll work on fortifying my defenses and getting getting a steady stream of materials going in. So I will see you next time.